This your boy Big Creep. Yeah, you already know what it is, man. What's happening, bro, bro? You not rocking with the chaotic vibes. Yeah. A DJ C Chaos. On IndioRadio.com. Check, check, check. You already know what time it is. DJ C Chaos, Chaotic Vibes, right here on IndioRadio.com. We got some special guests today. What's going on, fellas? Nothing much, man. It's chilling. It's In- Introduce yourself. Let them know where you're from. Man, you know, it's Big Tune, man. Southside. You know what's going on with me, man. Want to make a record. We coming. My name is Big Nick, man. I'm from Statesboro, Georgia, but I moved here about six, seven years ago and shit. We've been working together, and I'm just, and I'm just producing. Okay. Uh, you know, make a lot of the beats and stuff. So, so, so... What we like to do here, because I'm not from Georgia, so when people say I'm from the South Side or I'm from Stagesboro, we just like to pinpoint that on the map. We hear a lot of bad shit about Stagesboro. They don't. Yeah. They like to lock us the fuck up and don't yeah, yeah. and don't let us out. And what what part of the South Side is uh, are you claiming? I work South Side. I work for Ritter. Okay. Clean okay. So is Atlanta and Clean County the same thing? Because we've had. They like the same. Okay. You know, I okay. Here. Okay. 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 Like, like I said. I, I work for like the whole South Side, basically I stay the area, but gotcha. definitely, definitely for Clan Cat, I got you know like that the, the area I was raised in, you know, watch the road. Okay, watch the road, okay. Yeah, watch okay. the road, Kaipo, okay. Okay. Or Fall Pool, PA. Okay. Kind of road out there. Okay. See, you okay. know John was out. Most definitely. At home. Well, then, and, and where where is States Borough? It's like 40 minutes from Savannah. Okay. Southeast Georgia. Damn, I didn't realize it was that close to Savannah. That shit is far. So what is Statesboro like? Like, you know, we, we kind of are familiar with the city, Atlanta, you know, South Side, Jonesboro Road, all that. Yeah, they're like the same. Like, like it, just, it just a little more slower, but the same shit be going on. Yeah. And we got that big college. Yeah, so a lot of kids from Atlanta go to school at Georgia Southern. So, okay. just, you know, you know, it's the same old shit be happening in any city. So you know, most, definitely. most definitely, most definitely. So, so one thing I can say for a fact, especially for Tune, uh, you're moving. You know what I'm saying? You're doing your thing. You got some shit going on. Right. We right. seeing you. We seeing you. Um, I know you get a big response out in Dallas. Shout out to my man. Hit that. They playing that big bag real, real, real tough out there. Yeah. So just just give us a little insight of what's going on right now. Oh, uh, really, like, everything really just popping up. I just dropped, like I said, everybody know I just dropped the tape. What's Get Rich Kill trying the hardest. That, hardest out, not my opinion. Yeah, so a lot the of folk, Yeah, that's streets. The streets. Yeah. So the hardest out, period. Like, you got 21 songs. A lot of folk don't put that many songs on though. I was about to say, what, what made you do that, though? There's a lot of songs and for 2019. Straight, straight up, though, like, it ain't never just my idea because I got a team. Okay. It's, it's like, I thought, I mean, I could have thought more than 21. Yeah. But what I'm saying is, like, that, that's great to have a whole group of team that's with you. Yeah. And equally have the same mind of, like, now nah, we want to go more because I have more than 21 songs that could have went enough. Yeah. So it was just, like, the, I don't know, song that I put on there ain't number hits, really. Most definitely. straight up, and they like, we got to keep some, you know what I'm saying? We got to keep keep them flaming. We can really that 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 can stretch out. Like to this to the end of this year, we got so many because they find a new hit. So it was just like fact. with the whole mindset of a equalized team, a, 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 a progressive, and, you know what I'm saying? Smart and know what know what to do. It just went perfect. Like did what we're gonna do. We're gonna wrap it on twenty one. So and, so this is not your first mixtape. My my first official. A fit. That's what I was getting official. at. Like this, like the the, the first serious. Yeah, the first shit. serious. You know what I'm saying? Like the, so the, the other one, it it, 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 was, it is what it was, but it was yeah. just I was in a rush. Yeah. I wanted to do something yeah, yeah, yeah. so bad, so I ain't really. So this, are we using this as an as an official introduction to Tony? Yes. Yes. And, and what and what do you feel like that introduction was like? Other uh, than it being hard. What I can say, uh, I gave I gave you a lot of a lot of angles. You yeah. know what I mean by that? Like, I feel like the, the introduction show that rappers ain't boxed in and it's just one, and it's one-sided mind. Most definitely. Because I feel like everybody rap about that, that same lifestyle, yeah. that, that street, you know what I'm saying, that, that money. Like, I rap about that too, but yeah. anger yourself. Yeah. Have fun and take them folk through the stuff that they went through too. Most everybody definitely. ain't rich. You no, know, everybody it's ain't, ain't come fact. up just like that. So <laughs> stop, stop fact. forgetting where you came up from. Cause yeah. mostly now music, all you hear is like folk talking about, you know what I'm saying? How they, how yeah. they rich or whatever, and just pop. So I gave you a different angle. So, so one thing, one thing we like, especially about introductions, is like 
We're trying to figure out who you are. We're trying to figure out where you came from. I, f- I feel like, you know, when, when I got the tape that I got those vibes, but what do you feel like people are most, like, what do you want them to take away from the tape? Like, really just being yourself. Yeah. Like, I feel like, like I said, I feel like it had, it had a lot of motion. Emo- like, not it, the people who yeah. rap had a lot of motions in their music. Yeah. So they really got folks thinking you got to be this certain kind of character. Yeah. Out of my city, I feel like they're like, dang, bro, what you talking about? It's traveling the street, but then now he having fun. Like, yeah. he with the kid. He talk about his lifestyle, how he want to be in that kid life. And then he talk about how he want to have fun on the iPhone. Like, I give you so many angles. So, yeah. like, can he be all three of that? Yes, I can be all three of that. I, I am all three of that. Yeah. I'm in a street, I'm street, you know what I'm saying, nigga? Then a salad, all that, whatever you want to call it, whatever you want to label me. Yeah. Like, I tell anybody when they say who you is, I'm myself. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Stop judging. Stop putting it tight on yourself. Because then, as soon as you ain't right, they don't call you out, man. I don't want to be no street nigga. I don't want to be no real nigga. I don't want to be no gangster. I just want to be me. You want so me whatever you, Yeah, so whatever you judge me by then, that's what I am then. Yeah. But I'm saying, like, folk be like, you can't do all them angles. Yes, I done been in all them situations, the angle, and still know how to just talk about what, you know what I'm saying? Bring you some positive out of it instead of always talking about the, the street shit and all the other shit. Man, they, they boxed in like, nigga, if you was in love, you was in love. That's a fact. If you, if, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> you crying, you crying. Like, ain't no sucker for what you do. And that, yeah. that's, that's what the, the rap game been like to me. Like, yeah. you got a character out of it, man. You ain't be yourself. How, so, how you feel about when people say everybody from Atlanta sound the same? That is normal. Like, they always say that. I feel I'm definitely confident that I don't sound like nobody. Even if you do say it, I'd be like, all right. I don't be having no problem with that, though. Yeah. I know my, my music and my, and my, my personality going to show itself. More so, like, I'm always going to do whatever I feel right, and it ain't going to never be that done. Because yeah. I told you I'd be on so much of the positive. Yeah. So, that, that so, so you, you did you produce the mixtape? You, you, yeah. So, you got how many tracks you got on there? I'm not trying to go on about eight. Seven, eight. About eight. Uh, What's the process like working with Tune? Like, I can ask Tune what his process is like, but it's biased. What is his process? What's the process like working with Tune? It depends on what type of vibe we in that day. Some okay. days go quicker, some days go faster than others, then slower than others. Just yeah. Whatever how we feel, but it's a fun vibe because we did everything from scratch. Okay. Like every beat. I did, I cooked up on the spot, okay. right there on the spot that we came up with, you know, whatever, putting the concept together, then we go in there and lay it down, then it'd be over it. How, how did y'all even get together? Like, how did this duo, like, because like, I'm assuming this is your producer now. Like, y'all going to vibe it out. You know what I'm saying? Y'all going to do what y'all do. How did y'all uh, even link it up? My friend from college named um, Toots, whatever, Gator. Gator. They went to um, school together growing up in Forest Park, and then Gator came down to Georgia Southern and okay. went to college with me. Okay. Gator, my road man. So, you know, okay. Okay. probably so, all went to school together. So I've been knowing him for about 10 years, and when I moved to Atlanta, you know, he was getting into the music, and he was like, hey, one of my partners rap. I want you to work with them and y'all get together so we kind of just started from that. Okay. You know what I'm saying? How long ago was that? About? Last year. Last year. Last year. Last year. Okay. And we done went crazy. Yeah. We done went bonkers. Eight, eight, seven, eight tracks. And is that the only stuff y'all? Did you do any of the other things that like we pushing? Any of the singles? Yeah, like yeah. most of the singles that we did at my house. Uh, okay. 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 That's like that's. We got, like, more, we got more songs together. That was just the song that we put out. Yeah. On the tape. By yeah, yeah, yeah. I just wanted to be real hands on with this project, so we mixed and mastered the whole thing, made all the beats, recorded it there. We did the whole process, everything duh. Okay. You know. What and I'm when saying? he say that, he say when he say him. And we, he talking about his brother, cause his, bro- him okay. and his brother together. His brother is a part of the beat bag. Okay. Like, made the beat bag. Okay. You know? Okay. So, Jabo, like, he hard too. So, so it's almost like I get like a, a Metro Future vibe. You know what I'm saying? Or, uh, or even, even Jeezy Shorty Red. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, is that what you gunning for? Are we looking for some yeah. collab tapes and all that? Yeah, we got. Yeah, we. It's about he, trying to build a he sound. Creative, to build like, a we, sound. He creative. Like we. He creative. I'm creative. Yeah. The mind frame, like. Stun on like that takes so hard. I ain't even bragging on myself, but it that yeah. takes so hard. Like, and I know about it helping him, helped by my other folks. Like, yeah. we so creative, it sound different. Like, yeah. it ain't just everybody, everybody sound. What's the What's the goal with the tape? I like to ask that because you know a lot of people say some crazy shit. Like, I want to make a million dollars going tour, and just be like, you know, this is your first tape. Like, it's no. not impossible. 
But what is a realistic goal for this tape? My goal, definitely off this tape, is to be heard. Yeah. Like, I want to be heard, digging away. I, that's the goal. Like, if I be heard, I feel like it's going to go. Okay. You know what I'm that, saying? I just need to be heard. We need that recognition, and we need that respect, you feel? So yeah. this is the tape that's, that's going to get it. Going to wake up the whole city, wake up the whole industry. Then the follow-up tape will be bigger than that, because now we got yes. everybody watching and looking. Yeah. Everybody yes. watching and looking now. You feel what I'm saying? So, like... We had to just wake up everybody like nigga we hood type shit. But I was gonna say like like especially with the big bag record like Crazy. we've been we've been pushing that for a year at least. Yeah, you know yeah. what I'm saying? So it's like what what how does that feel? Because you're getting you got the recognition with that record. Like we've Fast. been playing that. Yes. You know what I'm saying? Now we are moving on to the project as a whole. Like, how does it feel? How does how do you feel like the progress is looking? How is it working? I'm gonna tell you something. That's one of the first songs he did, and they just put that one out first. But he got so many much so other many. harder songs, yeah. so you can't really judge, bro, off of the big bad record. Yeah. You say like that's it's the best song he got. Yeah. Like, nah, and I was different to say that. I was different to say the reason why I so come because when I came with like the last few songs, whatever song I played, when I came with the talking down, really, it was a whole different angle from big bag and on it. Yeah. So it, it, it shocked me like. I got, did what y'all, y'all going out, out talking down? I got more hot shit, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Stuff than that, so it was just like, I already knew I'm finna wake him up, cause that, it like don't, like I said, can't box nobody, and I'm, pers- I'm definitely a person you can't box. Yeah. You ain't gonna be able to box me in, cause I already know what's going on, like I know how to figure my way out there, so like, what's going on now is really doing way better than what I expect. Yeah. Like, with the stuff, like we, we expect it for doing, but it's going crazy, like I'm, yeah. getting, I'm getting crazy, like, Strange, crazy feedback from everything. Okay. Cause it ain't what it ain't what really what folks gonna expect. They thought they were gonna have the same image. Yeah. Let's uh let's play Big Bag right quick. Let's talk about it for a second. How did that record come about? We we I'm at I'm at uh Nick out in the studio working like usual. Yeah. They come up with some a concept, simple, easy. Let's yeah. Get it. We getting uh knocked down really just told them I got to turn up on these folk. Facts. That's what it really was, like you got to turn up on these folk and they're like, I make a lot of more what I want to say, I make a lot more emotion music, more pain on, yeah. on what's going on, you know what I'm saying, throughout the day or throughout the, or throughout the lifetime. So I'm, I just, that's how I just rap. Like, I just make a lot of more feeling. Yeah. Like, but I could turn up on you, so, man, get to these folk, man. Yeah. Let these folk know how you how you got it, how you popping. Like, all right, shit, let me go ahead and pop that. And with Nick being there to help me, it just came with the concept. Yeah. Really, we got two verses on there. Okay. I, my, my verses on there two times. Okay. We, when we heard it, I took it to it. To my uncle, when we heard it, it was like an automatic. But well, you can hear that that draw on there. Yeah. So that how we. That how we took him. yeah we took the second verse. Huh? Okay. So introduce it real quick. Let's be, let's get into it. Man, Big Bad, you know, produced by my brother Beat Nick and J Bo going crazy on the featuring Young Joe. Man, let's go walk for real. Song featuring Young Dro, Big Bad. Right here, ndlradio.com, mm-hmm. chaotic vibes podcast. Like, like those are that's a big cosign. That's a big feature, in a, especially in Atlanta. Yeah. Like, yeah. like, like. We're not gonna say that you're just this new guy that popped up out of nowhere. Like, right. we we know we know better, but that it's still re- relatively early for a drug feature. When they when they when they family connection, like yeah. Been my my family money maker record been been it. Got silent things like folk know about them, so it was just, it's yeah. already, it was silent. Like the car was so easy. Yeah. It wasn't no stress. Joe's silly here, too. <laughs> I think about the video shit. Yeah. <laughs> Joe's Joe silly, though. Like, just work with Joe Pierre, just a good time. Well, then he seemed like he got good good vibes, good character. Great, um, man. So, like, I want to take it back a little bit. You know what I'm saying? We, we didn't talk about the current. I want to kind of talk about the backside. Like, what are some inspirations to even get you in the game? Uh, some inspirations. Uh, I like, like I be telling everybody, like Ti definitely was a motivation. Yeah. Ti definitely was a motivation. Period. Like, cause I feel like he rap like I like on the same kind of level with that, with that just being yourself, like emotion, like yeah. speaking on that. So he definitely was a, was a motivation. But the insp- big inspiration is my kids. Okay. Like, that's the biggest one. Like, you know you want your head. Don't nobody want no fuck, want their kid to like. I want my kid right. to be like that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. They already like that. But I want them to live extra, live, live yeah. amazing and yeah. best life ever. Like, we good, but I want them. That's what I want. That's for my whole family. But yeah. 
Seeing that, seeing that smile on your kid face, man, that bigger than everything. Facts. Big facts. So that's just like, that, that the main inspiration. Like, I ain't got no choice. Like, I got I got my kid anyway. I ain't got no choice. Like, how does it feel to be a father in the rap game? Like, we all we all had different situations and different sides of that, but how does it feel to I live feel, it? I, feel like, I mean, because I don't take it no different. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because that's that what that it come with. So, like, like you doing music, you got kids. I don't, I don't see how you can take it different. You just gotta, you know, like, like, like somebody asked me how you separate the, the family from the, from the, from the music. Like you don't, you, it ain't, it ain't how you separate. You don't keep it together. You know what I'm saying? That's like different. when you, you family, you family. Like, you know, I'm just saying, together. like, it, it, it's, I, I would say keep it separate in the sense of, you know. You tune right. in the street, exactly. and then when you go and home, you know what I'm saying? You got to be, you I dig what I'm saying? But it's, it, I don't know, like, even as a DJ, it's tough, you know what I'm saying? Like, exactly. I work every day, you know what I'm saying? No different than a rapper, so it's like, I can't come home and, and scream right. like I'm on the bike at the, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, I got to, I got to, I got to, you know, I got to separate it in some ways. You got like, to, But. That's just it, a challenge. I, just, I don't, I don't have kids, so I always like to. I ask that because it's like, that's to me that'd be tough. It, it, I mean, it's a, it's just a challenge. Like, like it's just when you're trying to win, like everything, everything, everything happens for what the reason is. And like, yeah. if it ain't nothing negative, nothing they're gonna knock you out. Like, you good. Like that's what I'm saying. Like it just, it's just a challenge. Like, but I don't, I don't, it ain't, I don't change no other way. Cause even my kid, yeah. I got, I got to be how I am. You feel? How many kids you got? I got three. Okay. You been working, you putting in shit, putting in work. <laughs> hey, don't, hey, you know, when they have money, they put in some more work. Hey, you think you need to slow down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got okay. three, though. I'm, I'm blessed, though. Now, that's yeah. lit, though. That's lit. So, Shout out to you for that. Appreciate that's real. That. Um, so, like, you say you're from the South Side. We get a lot of people in, and they say they're from different places. I like to always, like I said, I like to describe to the people right. what it's like growing up on the South Side of Atlanta. Okay, like, and, and then you got some big dogs coming out of the south side of Atlanta. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So, how what type of vibe do you get coming? Like what? Like every artist, I feel like every side of town produces a different type of vibe. I mean, like on there, like we, I ain't gonna say like we we were just such different over there where I was at PA in my hood. It was just like on the south side, like everybody, man, everybody trying to get some money. Facts. They ain't trying to get, get no money, like. Like the extra shit, even if you were from the south side, you just doing extra. Like you, yeah. you tripping. Yeah. Like, like mostly like folks I hang around with, that, like who I kicked with, we was all on some some money getting moved, or trying yeah. to trying to make the other best decisions. I mean, the other option we got the best decisions. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So everything like that, that only thing we we on we on the pace on getting some money. We not. I say about where I'm from, we weren't really. We, it ain't. We ain't with that with that beef and that negativity. Yeah. Like all that, it, it killed, it killed. We look, we don't, we ain't getting a chance to even beef like, cause we don't do all that. That's why I'm so heavy on positivity. Yeah. Like I don't like that. I seen some, so many of my folk do their life over dumb shit. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? So that's just, that, that right there killed me. Like all that extra negativity, like, no, I'm not gonna be around. So got to know if I'm hanging with you, I'm around some positive vibe people. Most definitely. You know what I'm saying? Everything we, that we ever done, that, 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 was, that was old, like, Oh, shit. we didn't grow up out there. Yeah. So it's just like a different. It ain't nothing but a positive vibe around there. Yeah, I mean, and that, and that's lit. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's not too many. It's not especially like hood environments. It's not too many that you can feel yeah. that. You know what I'm saying? So what is what is Statesboro like? What is it? What is it? What's the vibe out there? What is it like growing mm -hmm. up out there? Cause that's different to me. Like I ain't yeah, never dude. even been out there. It's a lot more. I'm gonna say poverty, and it's like less opportunity down there. Yeah. So it's a lot more. Bullshit going on too. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Like ain't that many jobs down there. So you know how it just it's a little slower. Yeah. Yeah. But same old, same old shit. Everybody trying to get it, trying to make some money. Yeah. You know? Well, um, being from the south side, and you got a lot of big dog artists coming from out there. You know what I'm saying? Big dog artists. Yeah. Like, like, do do you feel pressure coming out the south side, knowing that you got to like take them reins? Listen, that's what I be telling for. I talk. I talk this positive vibe because I'm, I be letting folks know like we on a positive mission. Yeah. I don't feel shook by nobody like, but my side is the side though. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. I just talk like, folk really who be giving y'all these whole action of, 
oh, this the most hood, this the most gangsta. Like, man, he ain't, he ain't really ran into nobody. Yeah. So, like, music wise, yeah, I think I am the hardest out here on the south side. Okay. If it, if it, anybody got to the speak on it, you know what I'm saying? Fine, because that's my opinion. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I mean, that's how it should be, though. Definitely. So, that's what I'm saying. Like, come see, I feel like these folks should be scared. Come, I'm definitely getting hurt. Like, Most I'm move these folks out the way. Most definitely. Like, I got that. That's, that's hands, hand down. Like, I don't be just talking this into existence. This is a real fact. I know what's going on. I'm finna move these folks out of the way and everybody in. The music slowly for sure. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. They gonna understand, like, man, I'm not playing with these folks. For real. That's hard, though. Like, that how it, like, I feel like that's how it's supposed to be. Like, the humble shit is cool, but we all really know why we're here. We're not here to play the game with these niggas. We're not yeah. here. You know what I'm saying? So, I, I dig that. I, I like that a lot, actually. I really like that. So, moving forward, we got. Get rich or kill trying. What else we got? I mean, we ain't even got the title. We got a whole three more tapes. Yeah. Behind it. You know yeah. what I'm saying? I got so many. You know what? But only you folks, right? But we we both, we all know. Everybody, anybody that knows Tune for real. Right. Or even, not even just know you, but know about the movement. Right. We know it's not all about music. Right. Like, we, right. we, we, we got our hands in several. I'm hearing things in the streets. What do we have going on? Man, we, we we definitely we definitely working on that endorsement deal with Bella. Okay. Bella Black Bottle you. Boys. Black Bottle Boys. And they got that uh, <laughs> Bamboo. Bamboo, yeah. whatever. They got they got something else over there. Thing. Okay. We uh, we got the we, we already went up there and chopped up. We just, I just love New York too. Okay. Meant to say that. Too. How you how you feel about New York? I'm from New York. How you feel about New York? Got to go back. Up. <laughs> I went up there two times and still ready to go back up there. Like yeah. Fair and fair. Yeah, yeah. Most fair and busy. Most I definitely. thought it would be like it be up there. Get with slow. I, I think nobody should drive cars. Oh yeah. Like it's true. just a walking city and they gonna yeah. get you yeah. if you get in their way. So we're like it's a whole fair life with New York, it's a lot of business up there, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Okay. So I met up with the Bella at the top was very good. I brought home I brought home a, a few cases of them. Okay. Those facts. Yeah. Uh, I went up I went up the uh Barnfly. Okay. Barnfly rocking with me hard. Okay. So that's definitely gonna like I got I got fire stuff coming. I got the one stuff like I got some hard stuff. Born flying ain't even brought out in the stove. Yeah. They finna rock with me. Okay. So you know what I'm saying? We got we we got we got a lot of stuff going on with good endorsement. Went up went up there at top to uh I wanna say E1. E1. Yeah. We had chopped down with them, let it, let them hear the music like definitely a go. Okay. So it's just a lot of it. like everything really happened so fast on me, that's why I'm glad I got yeah. the management. That's what I'm saying. saying. Like, I'm like, I'm saying, hey, these blessings dropping so quick. That, like, it, it's, it's definitely a transition. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, to be one day to say, I want to rap, and then a year and some change later, it's like shh, endorsement on top of endorsement on top of real estate on top of shows. You know what I'm saying? Like, how is that transition for you? Uh, you got to be prepared. It, it's a fast transition, but it's, it's like. It's, My it's, man it's, back there it's, dying, it's, you ain't me. Hey, yo. He back here, that Hey, it is. It's just like, you know, it's a fair it's a, it's a fair transition, but at the same time, like I just you just gotta if you I feel like if this is something you add for some of the stuff you just gotta definitely. learn while you're doing it. Like that's what I be saying, everything, you know, it ain't common sense right there in the door, but it's just gonna make you find common sense. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So that ought to be like I just learn to see what I gotta do and I I go ahead and go with it. So I just transition with uh, learn from the situation. Yeah. So so we also have, or at least this is what I'm hearing, a clothing line in the works. New Rich. New Rich. Talk New about Rich. it. Holla at me. Talk to me. Come on. New Rich. Uh, Don't hold that on me now. No, I ain't gonna hold it. <coughs> New Rich is definitely a, a slang. That came up. Me kicking, popping it, popping, no, popping my, popping my, popping my stuff. No, yeah. I kicking it. No, really, my bad, my bad, my brother, Nick Fountain. Fountain word caught him. That's how I know folk be looking at Instagram hard. Yeah. I just be talking. Yeah. I just be populating nothing going on. It's kind of like might, he might. I think one night he had a show somewhere. I'm popping. Then I wasn't able to go, so I was home making making beats. So I, I went on Instagram and I saw he put a video up. He was like, new drip. He was like, man, I'm new fly. I'm new this. I'm new rich and that. Then when he said new rich, it clicked in my head like that's it. 
So I started making a beat, thinking about a new writ, new writ. Yeah. That's how the song even got on the mixtape. Yeah. Cause he said it, and it kind of hit like that's a that's a phrase. Like yeah. that's a, like, like, like that's it. That's yeah. it. That new writ shit. Cause niggas want to say they they new writ. They got the damn blue strips. They got yeah. the new writ shit. Like they trying to go up. So after that, everything is manifested from that to a whole clothing line. He about to lunch in a minute. Okay. And he got a big movement with the homeless. Here. They go out a lot, give a lot. You know, a lot of stuff don't even make film and yeah. you know get that's, documented. That's how and, it's supposed to be though. And you know like. It's about to get cold, so you know I know they probably about to go out there with ass of blankets and yeah. mittens, whatever, and look out for them folk. Cause it get treacherous in the winter time, you know what I'm saying? Definitely. Like Most I ain't definitely. know over there by Grady, there was a big ass tunnel under there, man. Yeah, it's, yeah, I, it's yeah, like a, yeah, it's yeah, like yeah. a, the yeah. tunnel like a hundred yards long, filled up with homeless people on both sides. That's a fact. I it's a whole little city under there. Breezeway F O one. He bought the whole Breezeway Air Force one. Yeah, I can't forget about that. Got a Sprinter van loaded up with Air Force ones. Everybody got a pair of shoes. Folks ain't doing that. Folks, you know what I'm saying? They they eat, but they also need shoes on their feet. You know what I'm saying? It glass. It's a lot of dirt shit on the ground. Like put put and just get them for some nice shoes. Like that's a fact. I'm just and then and then they were really from my blessing being thanked from my 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 real first chick. Yeah. Uh, my situation, I've I been getting money on my own, my regular stuff, but it was just my real first check. That's what I love to do is give. Yeah. That's what I do is give. Like, that's what I, I did the big school thing. Yeah. yeah back school, school drive, school, everybody, like I'll kill you on the phone. Like, it was wrapped around the building. Yeah. We provide that, man, man, everybody had a good time. Like, that's my biggest thing, man. I love to give. So, so is, is the New Rich line. A clothing line, or is it like a, a fundraiser for? Nah, it's definitely gonna be a clothing line. Oh, it's gonna, okay, okay. it gonna be a clothing line, like in the works. Okay, okay. This ain't okay. nothing but a little, you know, prototype I got on, but you know, this is. Oh, so that's some new rich right there. Yeah, so, so it got, it got new rich, it got money making records mm-hmm. for two. Okay, put it in the you camera, let's see. You know what I'm saying? Prototype. Two got all kinds of shirts and stuff, man. All oh, type yeah. of lo- different. We looking, we looking forward to some new got, rich. Just you heard? New rich. Like this nigga, new rich, it just, just happened. So yeah. like, shit, nigga, really catching the mix and going off with the thing after a while. People gonna be saying, y'all remember this? They gonna start saying this phrase, and y'all know when y'all heard it first and saw it at first. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? They gonna try to run off with the drip, with this man yeah. drip. Nigga be like, man, I'm new rich, man. I'm popping. Like, All right, y- y'all gonna see it in the video. Like, that's, 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 that's a fact, though. That's a fact. Gotta be a trend, son. Yeah. Before don't let, don't let it overhype it. Like, these folk hear what I'm saying. It's a lot of stuff I've been saying before a lot of folk. They just bite it. So, so with the giving back, like, where does that come from? You say you, you just have a giving spirit. I, 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 like I said, I just want to see the smile on my is, kid. Is there is there like a a nonprofit behind it? Is there anything like that, or is just this is just you coming it's just out? Me. Yeah, okay. it's just, I, I don't, I don't, I'm not looking for nothing. Okay. Like, everything, that's what I just want. Like I love to see smile on folks' face. Like I'm gonna go out for Mother Day for if I'm cool with you for your mom. Yeah. And get her some. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Cause yeah. I want to be. You did, man. It, I, don't, I don't see how folks don't like that. Man, it's kind of like it's it. kind of like we trying to blow up, so we need all the positive energy and karma we can get. So whatever the blowing karma. up. Yeah, see, you, and you got to have God like in the equation, you know what I'm saying? When you do working hard out here doing this stuff, that way you got to give back a lot. A lot of people don't even talk about God. A lot of people don't even talk about giving. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? They rather flex a new bus down than, than to go to a, a private spot like deal with the homes and give them food and yeah. clothes and stuff like you got to get all your blessings, so That's you got to do good to get yeah. good. That's a fact. You know, they're supposed to come back tenfold, you know what I'm saying? So if this man do get a bigger deal tomorrow, he deserves it. Yeah. Man, I get, what, about I get what, though. It, we ain't, we ain't really got to blow up and get a bigger deal. Like I'm legit giving, man. God gonna bless you anyway. That's, that's, why a I, that's a definitely, like I told you, without the, you can take that camera off me, you can take that deal without me. I do stuff like that, period. Yeah. yeah. I do stuff like that, period. So, like, without the camera, without the, uh, the photo, you know, like, I just, that's what I wanna do, just give. Like, that's what I do. So, it ain't nothing new. Like, that's it's hard, though. It, it, it's, it's, it's rare that you come across people who just want right. to do it. You know what I'm saying? It's because we don't see it on the camera. Like, you wouldn't right. even think nothing of it. But it's like, the fact that you're doing it, it's still hard. You know what I'm saying? It's not too many people out here just doing it for genuine, you know, reasons other than, oh, I'm going to put this on the gram so people mm-hmm. can think I'm mm-hmm. I'm hard or whatever the fuck. It's like... It's like certain stuff need to be documented and certain stuff don't. Yeah. So, like, some people do it to flex and some people do it for motivational purpose only. Yeah. Fast, so, fast. to see a whole Sprinter van full of shoes and clothes and stuff come up and give to a whole section of homeless people, that's motivational purposes. That's a fact. Now, catching a guy laying by the gas pump and you giving him $5 trying to be on some flex and stuff like in front of them, that kind of lane, you feel yeah. me? Yeah. Not that you know real. So that's super real. Depending on how you are, that's how you're going to take it. Some people might take that as flexing, but others might take it as motivation. Yeah. yeah. 
It yeah. depends on your your mindset. If you're a positive person, that you know what I'm saying. If you're a hater, that you know what I'm saying. That, that's, that's a hater. fact, though. Yeah, you gotta stay over there. That's a fact. Let's get back to the music, man. We got uh, Talking Down. Tell me a little bit about it. Talking Down is my song. That's my, that's my personal song. Like, it's my personal song. Like, for, you got really excited when I said folk, Talking Down. I got real excited. <laughs> that's why you got list man. It's just really basically folks who hate on your situation don't know what's going on. Okay. That's man, it's, it's like. When he was, he was at one of the lowest points in his life, and a lot of people that are supposed to be in there and supportive, you might go to them trying to talk to them to go get some positive help or some positive feedback. They might take that and talk about you yeah. to the next person yeah. or tell somebody that, you know what I'm saying, telling your business. So it was inspired by some real events. Okay. You know what yeah. I'm saying? And he's like, stop, just talk, stop talking down on somebody. You don't, you yeah. don't know what's going on. You don't know what like, got Stop going talking on. down on them. Like, Fact. that's it, period. Yeah, man, they kind of came from that. Introduce this motherfucker. Let's get into it. Yeah, talking down, man. Fuck the crazy yeah, going like, on, man. The hottest noise right now in the street. And you know how we yeah. come for real. Stop talking down on me if you ain't talking good. At all. Really don't understand. You already know what time it is. Talking down, tune right here. IndiaRadio.com. Chaotic Vibe Podcast. Like I said, you got real excited when that came on. Yeah. It's, a, it's the song we pushing right now. It's hard. But again, like... Okay, cool. It came from a real situation. Right. But that is like your baby, the way you react. You just sat here and you know, damn near you know, performed those shit. You know what? Because them, them, be the, them be the type of song that get a little past. You got to put them on a the CD. The sleep. Yeah. Like, you got to hear the beat bag. And, uh, yeah. You got to hear the uh, the new rich probably like first. Because them folks don't want to hear nothing like yeah, that yeah. right now. You know, like, man, I don't care what you talking about. You know what I'm saying? So it, it, made, me, it got, made me so happy because they got caught. Like, yeah. oh, I told y'all these what these folks want to hear. Like, yeah. It's something they had in the kitchen. I knew the concept what we were going to get, and that was yeah. like the nah, nah, nah. Yeah. Like, I put that in my mind. Like, I got to make some, some girls to say, too. Yeah, you know what I'm that's a fact. And that's going to make sense to the situation I'm talking about. That's a and fact. And it hit right perfect. So it was just like, I'm speaking on, I'm speaking on with folk. Don't be talking about feel. Right. So that, that's like, how it be. I feel like. So one thing I wanted to speak on, because you got a lot of buzz off of it, um, tune, tune, Comes arrives to his listening party in a helicopter. helicopter. In the ghetto bird. In the in helicopter. In the hood. In the hood. On Metropolitan. Uh, what 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 made you do that? Team. The team. Yeah, the team said we got we got to put a stamp on it. Crazy. We already up through that like like I said. I don't. It ain't never by myself. That's why yeah. I never like I thought I thought the same like. Yeah. The, the, wouldn't do some big like so we, yeah. when it came to it, how everything be such agreement. Yeah, I say I got a solid team like. They really turn their dreams into reality. And do you own a helicopter? Is that like is that how that worked? Nah, nah, oh. I'm, I'm family with that. Oh, okay. Okay. I don't own a helicopter. Cause get what I'm gonna tell you the truth. I don't, I don't too much. <laughs> you want to get on the helicopter, the plane, but I do it. Yeah, like I've been on the plane somewhere, been on the helicopter somewhere, but I still be up there. Even when I was up there. Yeah. I was like, I got God with me, God with <laughs> Nah, that's a fact. We're going to make it through here, but it was definitely a pipe-up situation. You know, you got to look at the view and look at the time. Like, you just blessed. Like, I'm talking about, bro, they had the red carpet rolled out. The I mean, bad you know about the Louis, Louis Look, 13, man. Them folks ain't Love and Hill Hop was out there. I'm talking about it was a big, man, compelling man. spectacle. It was lit. We bought, a hel- we bought a helicopter to the hood and dropped it in the middle of Atlanta. <laughs> Got that shit cleared by the city. The, the, the police roped that motherfucker off. Dropped that bitch. Whole park of that, man. Yeah. A whole helicopter out that bitch. Everybody brought the chat, man. Y'all damn near should have just landed that bitch on top of the court. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> should have, should have, man. Really, we gonna get some motherfucking animals in there in a minute. I'm trying to tell you, man. Nah, nah that, was, like, that was one of the, that was probably outside of just music. That was like, hey, I got a phone call, hey. Tune just dropped the helicopter. I'm like, what the fuck you mean? I'm thinking it's like lingo. Like, nah, that nigga really just came. He pulled up in the helicopter. And the folk, and the folk buying my stuff. Yup. Yep. I just say it's folk doing it. Like, that's what I like though. I want, I want a train. I want to make a train my own train. Yeah. So if you, if you, you gonna go on my train, and let go. Make sure you just remember. You gotta have I a big bag to fuck with Tune. Got to. Yeah. Shit, not even that. They gotta have the concept before you even want to even do it because like a lot of niggas got money but they don't got the concepts yeah. to do certain you stuff. You, you know what I'm saying? You gotta, mindset, you, gotta, yeah, yeah. you gotta be yourself, you know what I'm saying? And that's where that's how I'm winning. I'm doing yeah. myself. You gotta have that mind frame, like for real. How do you folk tell them that you wanna get it? Go do it, man. 
You gotta make your own mindset and do how you do. That's uh, a fact. Cap. Do it like nobody else. You gonna lose. So, um, we got we got get rich at your kill train. We got any videos off the tape? What we just big bad. Just big bad. Only 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 the last song. Um, just big bad. Only um, we got video coming. I was gonna say, what, what can we look forward to? I know you're gonna. We got a video coming. I'm definitely. You're not gonna do 21 videos, are you? Nah, they're gonna do one for myself, because they love that song myself too, I think. Myself is crazy. And probably okay. New Rich. Nah, and top they, down. They got a lot of stuff. His brother's so busy traveling, they ain't yeah. had time to really do no yeah. visuals. Myself. He just did a fire vi uh, shoot yesterday, a photo shoot. He was out there for hours. Nigga with ties for on my birthday. On your, on your birthday working. We ain't what you do shit. for. It. You ain't do nothing for nothing. Work. We're working. What I, you did, I did do something for that. I did what I want to do. I did the music. Yeah. Did, that, yeah. You know, that real. That photo really woke up. That yeah. what I did. I woke up. So. That's, that's Man, hard. I'm lit though. It was great photo shoot. Happy belated, my brother. I appreciate that. Happy belated. Um what else we got coming up? New mixtape. We spoke on new music. We don't necessarily. Tour. We finna do. We finna tour the southeast. Tour. Yeah, yeah. Okay. About to hit southeast Georgia, South man. East Georgia. Got where I'm from. We got to turn up. We, finna, we, finna, we gotta hit the country one time. We finna tour okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Cause like they ask. Yeah. Ask I mean, like, like we 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 get the music. We've been like, you know what I'm saying. I've been having the music, right. so I know the people are drawn to it. Exactly. You know what I'm saying. Now it's just time and time to like kick them in the mouth with it. Yeah, see, yeah, was, yeah. I just had to really put that face on too. Yeah, I remember really, I was just so focused in the studio. Fact. Really out there, you know what I'm saying? Fact, because I didn't get the, I didn't get, the, I don't yeah. think I got any music from you. Yeah, yeah but everybody yeah. else got. It. It. You know what I'm saying? That's, That's why I said I had to get myself out there and go ahead and make my own vibe with my own people, let them know who I am. So. That's helping me definitely a lot. You know what I'm saying? I see, cause I'm still, like I said, I'm still, I'm in the game. I, I, just, I just got pros and folks who've been knowing this and solid people that's telling me, but I'm still just as new as everybody else. Yeah. And I'm still learning, so it's like, yeah. oh, then what you got to do? You got to get out here and meet these folks. Facts. Got to touch these people. Everything about time, time management. Time, right? yeah. So we trying to get all these visuals out the way before we start going on these tours, cause we about to hit a college tour. Yeah. We about to hit Southeast Georgia. So mm -hmm. once that stuff start happening, we ain't gonna have time to be in the yo or damn shoot no visuals for real. Yeah. As we shooting them on the road yeah. while, they, while they performing. Right. So yeah. They're trying to get everything organized, situated. Okay. So, so what else, anything else we got looking forward to? Man. Other than new it. money, new car. Not just playing. Get whatever you say. Huh? Just go get that CD, man. If you ain't Facts. got it, go get that CD. We're going we gonna to thread you and, and go down your throat about that CD because it's the hardest, man. Don't and if you see the posters around town, you can get your cell phone and, and scan it. Scan that motherfucker. You don't have nothing. Okay. They so all get, over the get, city. Get, every get gas pump, every trying. light pole. The hardest pole. out, man. And, and just keep going up. Just and, and then what I say to every, every time, and I appreciate y'all. I appreciate DJ. I want DJ to know. To, to all y'all, I honor the blessing yeah, that y'all have been saying. You don't got no DJ, and you don't, I mean, you gotta have more than one. You ain't got no, you ain't, you ain't got no relationship with no DJ, you lost. That's, so that's a fact. That's a fact. Appreciate y'all, appreciate the promoters. Salute to you. I appreciate my team, and no, most of all, I appreciate God. Well, definitely. Give your shout outs before we get up out of here, man. Give me social media shit so we can find shit. Oh, yeah, man. Mm -hmm. Make sure you go on my uh, social media for IG, uh, Facebook, whether it is Snapchat. You got a Twitter, that's Tone, T O O N, underscore C L B. You can follow me on all that. Yes, I'm, I'm accepting a friend request, I'm riding your bed, messages, whatever, it don't matter. Not never never too goddamn arrogant or, or Hollywood, I'm always me. So hit me up, let me know. If it be 80 days later, I'm still gonna get back to you. And man, shout out to the whole team, Money Maker Record, man. No days off. NBO Radio going crazy, let's get it. You heard? Yes, sir. You got any shout outs? Shit. Shout out to Toon, shout out to Money Maker Record, the South Side, Statesboro, Sober, them, the whole Southeast Georgia. Shout out for them for pushing me and motivating me to goddamn come up here and do all this shit, because a lot of people from where I'm from don't never leave that bitch. You feel That's what I'm saying? Fact. And so, shit, we're here catching some motion, so shit, I'm going to get my resources and everything I get from up here, I'm going to visually take it back down up. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Make some shit shake. You That's feel me? Oh, yeah. oh, yeah, I got to say CLB, they're, they're, they're my family. They were, they were tatted on me, so, okay. you know what CLB stand for? No cow. Feels like brothers. And that's okay. my, they're my brothers like Polo, Scoop, Trey. It ain't, it ain't too many of them. Peasy, man, you know, you know, man, Dre, I got to say their name. Cause you know, my boy Cool. Scoop, uh, Cool, got to get cool. You know what I'm saying? So shout out to yeah. CLB, that's the side of the team. We ain't deep. So when I number like six, you know what I'm yeah. saying? Six something. Six of fish. So yeah. like, we, ain't, we ain't deep. So that, this CLB stand for close like brothers. Okay. So shout out to the whole team. We shouted, man. We up.
Shout out to everybody, man. Shout out to the world. Appreciate everybody tuning the fuck in. Chaotic Vibes Podcast, IndiaRadio.com, DJC Chaos, and we signing off.